Hey everybody, my name is Sesmok and I'm a sales trainer here at ENS Security. And today we're gonna to be talking about our brand new four megapixel diamond line covert pinhole camera. And matter of fact, it was right here in between the water cups. So a little bonus points for you if you're able to see that. Really excited to be jumping into this camera. So let's jump into the specs. Let's jump into the specs with this new pinhole camera. First thing mentioning, it is a four megapixel with 20 frames per second. And it does actually have a 2.8 millimeter lens, which is a standard fixed lens camera. And it does have a built-in mic, so it can record audio as well. It does support wide dynamic range and does have IVS features such as tripwire and intrusion. And it does support starlight capabilities as well. So you do get some color at night options available with this unit. Um, quick little mention, you do need to have a 12 volt power supply to get this unit powered up. However, to connect this camera to the network, you can just connect it directly from the camera with a Cat5 cable into the recorder. It's just not gonna be PoE powered. You do need a 12 volt power supply to get that powered up. This also can technically be a standalone unit if you want to just view live view. There's no SD card on this unit, so you can't do any recording and storage on it. However, you can watch it on live view if that's what you're needing to do. Also, it does have some extra ports on the back, like an audio input and an audio output. And it is super easy to mount this as well with a little bracket that you just have to unscrew and be able to adjust the camera to the perfect angle that you actually need. And my absolutely favorite part about this unit is there is no encoder that is required. A lot of the times you see pinhole cameras require an encoder and a separate box and it's a whole process to get set up. This can just go directly from the camera to the recorder, which is a huge advantage for this unit. Now, before I jump into the exact applications, I do want to talk a little bit about the covert camera. Uh, there's no doubt that there is some type of controversialness when using this camera. These cameras sometimes are used in improper ways, being installed in places that aren't legal and are unethical. Well, with this type of camera, I promise you guys, there's plenty of ethical and legal ways this could be used. And you'd be surprised about the different places that these types of cameras are used and what kind of advantage this can actually offer you during your installations. These types of cameras can be used in a variety of ways. First little mention I wanna talk about on this is in a grocery store, where maybe in the back of the store, inside the manager's office, there is a safe that has cash that typically fills cash registers. Typically these offices actually already have a security camera in them. I've worked at a grocery store, I've seen them, they're in there. But at the same time, it's very easy to block out that camera, right? If you're accessing the safe, you can put your arm up either side and be able to block that view. Well, with the pinhole camera, you can mount it in a location that the employee doesn't know exactly where it is. And it's only gonna be viewing the safe. So if somebody opens the safe and they're trying to hide their you know, movement from a different camera, if they were to reach in there, the pinhole camera could capture them trying to slide a couple hundred bucks into their pocket, ultimately reducing theft and employee theft in that business. Now, the next example I wanna give you guys is banks and specifically ATM machines. There's a lot of type of fraud that happens at these types of machines and banks would love to install these types of cameras directly onto the ATM machine to catch any type of fraud directly in action. Now, the third application I wanna mention is specifically elevators. And this can apply to anywhere with an elevator, commercial real estate, casinos, hotels, apartments, whatever it might be. A lot of times in these elevators, you see in the top corner or directly where you input the buttons, a small camera that's covering the inside of the elevator. And a lot of these locations that include elevators love get these installed. To get this video wrapped up, this type of camera can be installed in banks, specifically inside of an ATM. It can be installed in a elevator, specifically in a hotel or a office building and including high sensitive areas. And it comes with a huge benefit of not needing any type of encoder, making it an easier installation for you. And it being four megapixel instead of two megapixel, which is the standard for pinhole cameras. To get this picked up, go to make sure to give your ENS sales rep a call. Yeah.